this also means that no one will be spies on service. Hello, welcome back to Risk and Reward Season 14. We're playing Risk of Draw. The draw will happen soon. We're currently not looking the best on armor, but that's okay. Let's grab uh, some of this. Uh, well, I want to I want to grab some flint real quick. See if I can get anything. Let's, I want to see if I can get a flint. Maybe I can even find some more iron through this, and I can prove myself wrong by making that by making that sword. But if I get thrown into the first duel, I'm probably dead because other people will definitely have full iron before me. But that's okay. Regardless, I will, I'll just die. This could be the last episode for me, and if it is, oh well. I had fun, and uh, it's always good to play some UHC. All right, let's head out of here. If I find Karaski now, we're going to be in some big trouble because we don't really have anything to protect ourselves with. No one's really down health anymore. People are down a little bit of health, but nothing too notably at least. Everyone's uh, looking pretty good. The lowest anyone is in nine hearts, so everyone's looking pretty good on the PvE today. Which is nice to see. Alright, let's head up and hope that we don't get thrown into the first duel. I'm going to go into this somewhat fearless. Alrighty, spider right there. Hopefully he doesn't despawn by the time I get over there. If we can get some string, it'll be good. Because if someone else has a bow and they shoot arrows and they miss, I'm going to be able to use that to my advantage and use those arrows against them. So let's start. There's arrows here on the surface too. That's good. One string, good start. I'll happily take that. Uh, I don't think there's anything else here of any use. Ender pearl could potentially actually be useful, but it's obviously not a good idea in this kind of scenario. So we don't really have much, although I feel like going this way is probably the best option as there really isn't much to do. Although there is an opening to a cave system right here which would probably get me something. More arrows here, I will happily take those. Don't walk into the cacti. I'm going to head down here see if... No, nothing there, okay, never mind. I was going to head down there maybe see if I can get some more iron, but nope. Okay, so we are going to be boating across the sea. And hopefully no oh shit is falling going up. Fuck back 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 up back up back up back up. At least I uh I think that was definitely Kowalski. I think it was. Either way we're gonna be avoiding him. Hopefully he doesn't come after us. Either way we're in a boat, so we should be fine. We can try and avoid him. We're gonna try and get over that sea. He definitely took the correct path. I took the wrong path. We're stuck in this kind of peninsula island which oh oh is that cut or is that oh is that dumb? That's probably dumb. He could have definitely killed me there. So that's a little bit of a concern. He had full iron, I did not. So that means Kowalski. Oh, wait, maybe it was Dom I, maybe it was Dom I saw, not Kowalski. That would make sense, considering I saw Kowalski at the very beginning and I saw Dom just now. So that would make a lot more sense if it was Dom I just saw and not Kowalski. So, yeah, currently we're in a terrible position. If we don't get full iron by the end of this day, we're in, we're in a tough spot. But if Dom's going that direction, because he knows the border's over here, so I don't think he'd come after me. I don't, I don't think that would be smart, at least until the first draw, because if he's on low health and then he gets picked for the draw, he's in a bad he's in a bad position. Then again, same with me, so hopefully I don't get picked for the first draw. But if I get picked for the first draw, I'm dead anyway, So because I don't even have full iron. So we're going to stick by the border for now, and we're going to try and find any kind of cave. The second I see that temple, though, will you go in the opposite direction, or at least try and avoid as much as possible, because I don't want to deal with it. This island, this, this, this island, unfortunately, has Dom on it, and I'd rather not deal with him, so... We'll go the other way. What's his health? He's on 9.5, so although we're on better health, in terms of armor, he has full, we only have two pieces. So, not the kind of person we want to fight. I do want to fight people at some, at some stage early, but right now, I need something first. I need some armor first, so... I could dig down here, at the... In, inside the ocean. Now that would probably be pretty safe. There's a little air pocket right there too. All right, do we want to do that? That could be smart. Taking out the ocean. Nah, I don't think that's too risky, right? Gotta be. Especially because we're just close to the border, though. Would it be risky? We don't really have much wood. Hmm. I feel like that would get us killed. I don't really want to risk it. Maybe if we find a safer spot. I feel like I think I think we just got to keep boating until we get anywhere. But although, is it turning night already? No, it's about halfway. Okay, but I feel like if we just keep crossing this ocean, well, we're just gonna end, we're just gonna end up finding some uh, someone else's land. Four minutes. Oh god. Okay, I am definitely gonna be in the. Uh, if I am in this battle, it's game over. Unless someone else, unless the person I fight doesn't have any armor. Dude, this is just endless fucking ocean. What is going on? Holy shit. 
Okay, there's a land. It's something. It's a forest. Great. Now, the thing is, someone's probably on this island, but we'll see. It's a forest. That means potential for apples, but I'm not interested in apples. I'm just interested in, uh, I'm just interested in a cave or some iron. So let's just go on here, dig down, and we'll see what we get. First things first, equip our dirt on a hot bar. Land on the island. Lock in. Right, we're gonna go down. And it's already uncovered and it's already covered by grass, so that's promising. Okay, so we gotta get some iron together quickly before the first battle, just in case it is us. But either way, we shouldn't focus on that. We should just focus on playing the game as well as we normally would. Just saw a name about me, that would have been bad. Alright, let's see here. Let's uh, do this, let's grab all this stuff. This is all useless. Come some coal is good, but I want to make oh shit ravine. Alright, that's good. Let's see if we can let's see if we can get make this. I don't want to miss the water, I don't want to be what don't, don't want to do what Katie did in Pathfinder. Uh, that is makeable, but do I want to risk it? No, it's all the way down here. Let's see if we can make a little bit of a safer drop down there. Equip our cobblestone again. It's a little safer. I have all that water and I think I'm gonna make a jump. Cool. I'm in. Alright, let's grab the iron. Promising, very promising here. I feel like once the first door is called, if it's not me, then that's okay. As long as I get full iron, I'll be, I'll be, I'm feeling pretty, pretty, I'm feeling fine about that. Okay, let's also quickly make another pickaxe. We're gonna, we're gonna be, we're gonna be making iron pants with the, uh, with the iron we've got here, by the way. There's iron up, there's iron on the surface there too, nice. This is another 8 vein, excellent, okay that'll be full iron. Whether or not I'll be able to get this cooked enough before the first battle is another question altogether, we'll see. 10 more. Just put this in another furnace completely. Nice job. Okay. Until then, there's a skelly in here. Who I'd rather not encounter, personally. I'm gonna one through here. That's concerning. That means I think that means that someone's been in here. If they would, they've really left all this stuff. Now nah, they wouldn't have been here. They would have uh, water bucket all this. Oh, shit, that was close. Let's turn it now. Okay. So burning a Nihon in the first fight. Interesting. We'll see how that goes. Oh shit, that was uh, that's conspicuous. If that was a player, who would have? That would have been funny. Kill those guys. So basically, either Nihon or Burning is about to get first blood. That'll be a, that'll be interesting. Yeah, okay, we're about to say farewell to yet another player soon. Who it will be is still yet to be determined. We'll soon see. Uh, Nihon's on more health, but we'll, we'll see if that actually changes anything. 
our torch is on tap, I think. Just have to see what, what happens. Actually, I don't really want to... I, don't, I, wanna, I wanna keep focusing on the game, personally. We'll see what they have. See, so yeah, if one of them has a bow, I think that'll be a good win for Burning or, or, or Nihon there. I don't know if Nihon would have a bow already. Burning might. Nihon's already down three hearts, though, so Burning may already have a bow. If he's any more geared than that, I don't know. Um... Oh. Burning to a slain by Nihon Tiger. GG. There you go. Burning is down. Yeah, this really seems like someone's been here already. This really feels like someone's been here already. Like, like just based on the, uh, oh, just, just based on how these, uh, these things are mined, it doesn't even feel like someone's actually been here. Which is a big concern to me. This, these creepers just fall from the sky. What is going on? Let's see. Um, oh yeah, I'm a little worried that maybe someone else is in here based on how these ores are generated. It really does uh, make you worry a little, but that's all good. That's the name of the game. I'd rather not lose Iron Man to a bunch of skeletons, if possible. Uh, let's not deal with that. Yo, come at me. If you could drop me a bow, that'd be fantastic. Fortunately, my life is not got lucky enough for that. Thank you. I'm gonna head up here and grab some water real quick. Uh, I don't see anything else too, too, too amazing down here yet, that's fine. As long as I get something in the end, that's all right. I see diamond, yes. That means no one's been here, because they would have definitely won the diamonds. I think I'm just getting overly paranoid by strange holes in the ground. But I see diamond, so that's good. And I have a small bit of lapis, and there's definitely more in this cave for me to grab, so that's all good. If I can get enchanted, I'll definitely head up early. Definitely saw diamond over here. And a spider. This off two string, we're just set. Yes, dude! And gold. Holy shit, this is everything I ever wanted and more. Gimme, gimme, gimme. And I hear more cave. Four gold. One. I think this might just be four, that's fine, it's a good start. Four diamonds, great. Make it a bit of TNT too. Alright. Very good stuff here. I'm gonna keep grabbing redstone. I feel like if I feel like if since Shadoon is playing, there's a good chance he'll probably be able to he'll he'll probably have some potions. So I'd like to defend myself against that, if that ends up being a thing. Now that this is done, this area is done, we can block it off. No more concerns will come from there. Here though is another, it's another story altogether. There is another massive area for cave here. Large potential for diamonds, but probably none. We'll see. Checking this little section, nothing. That's fine. I'm not in any interest. Check this out, nothing in here. Oh, there might be. No, okay. Quickly now, let's make our bow. Because I do have arrows. So, worst case scenario, I now have a bow to shoot things with. 
to shoot people with, and maybe witches. Witches is really the only other thing I'd consider using them on. Oh, our angry skeletons that could be in my, that could be in a mess. Right, uh, there is more around here, which could be good. Do I want to risk it? I may have to. This is risk and reward after all. Some things you just gotta risk to gain the rewards. For example, down here. Huge risk, potential for high reward. Benny burned to death. Good game, Benny. Unfortunate for you. No thunder too, so uh, maybe never. We'll see what happens. But either way, he's down. He's out of the competition. That's another person I don't need to deal with. They won the game, and a good player I don't need to deal with later in the game. Sad for him, but oh well, that's how we go. No matter how he died there, I'm sure he found a way to make it enjoyable, because that's what Benny does. He always makes deaths a little bit more interesting than they, uh, than they technically should be. Right, I'm out of cave here, so I'm going to find something else to do. I know there was another part of the... I know there was more of the ravine. Somewhere. I don't remember where the ravine was, though. I think it was uh, somewhere. I think it was past here. It's like, yeah, this, yeah, this was our original ravine where we dug into. Okay, there's a bit more over there. I was hoping they'd just uh, sleep him in, but oh well. It's fine. Grab more iron. Okay. Anything down here? Yep. Nope, nothing. Okay. So if there's nothing down here, then in that case I'm going to have to make another move. Which is alright. Uh, let's grab this coal quickly. Because this is another item I'm definitely going to need more of in the game. I'm already level 13, that's good. High levels, high reward. So the battle's every 20 minutes, so there'll be one in... So there'll be one 10 minutes after each episode, basically, from episode 2 onwards. So that's how it works. That's how the risk of draw works. Now, meanwhile, I definitely heard more water. I think I heard more things in general, to be honest. I was possibly wrong. We'll see. May have to go back up to the surface now, which is which would be fine personally. I, I'd be okay with it at this point because I have a bow and I have I have a few arrows, so I can at least defend myself against other players. So I wouldn't be completely defenseless at this stage in the game. So going up at this point, I feel a little bit better. So let's head up, I think, at this point, and maybe we'll be able to do something. In terms of players, I don't, I'm not really too afraid of anyone at the moment. Should do, okay, this is going to be a problem. All right, let's find, we should be able to do this fine. Let's, uh, let's do this. This is what, this is what I do normally whenever I'm in a, whenever I'm in a situation like this, just in case I can't get to the surface in time, I, I build a little pillar. And uh, what this does is allows me to get a little bit of an air hole when I do that. So that if I end up not being able to make it to the surface in the amount of stuff, in the amount of blocks I've got, I'm able to do that to uh, make sure I have enough. So, while I'm here, I guess I may as well try to get a few apples. Um, no, no, I uh, may as well do that. There's a few mobs up there, though, which is kind of making me feel a little worried about doing that, but I do need more wood. So, this puts me in a little bit of a predicament, doesn't it? So there's a skeleton up there. I don't really want to use my arrows to kill him. So I'm going to have to try and get up a different way to the island, take out the creeper, and then take out the skeleton. Let's get some blocks. Granite is fine. Is 
that's the end of episode two. And we'll see you next time. Oh, he missed. Nice. Thank you.